Hello everyone, Mark Callender with the Callender Home Team and Remax Results and I want to thank you for watching today. Um, I'm going to talk about your property lines for your home and encroachments. Encroachments are anything that could be over a person's property line from the next property over or vice versa. Something that you think is on your property and you've actually put it on your neighbor's property. Um, a lot of times we see fences on the wrong side of the property. We see sheds that might be encroaching, um, let's say, a drainage easement in the backyard. And the seller built it, didn't even know there was a drainage easement back there. I see these things a lot. They're pretty easily fixed. But there are times where when you have your title work done, when you're selling your home or you're buying a home, title work will find these encroachments and these issues with the property. And usually they have to be resolved before you can close on them. Um, so that brings me to the next point. Finding your boundaries, finding your property lines is actually fairly simple. Before your house is built, they platted out the development and they platted out your lot. And they take these iron spikes and they drive them into the ground and they're down about three inches on the corners of your properties. So a really easy way to find your property lines is to go to the corners of where you think your property lines are, grab yourself a metal detector, and those, again, those spikes are about three inches down on the corners of your properties, and you can usually find those pretty easy. If you have to, um, when you pull a permit to either put up a fence or something like that, you can get that permit, but you know it is a responsibility of the installer, whether it's yourself or whether it's a professional company installing these, they have to find those property lines and usually there's a setback two three feet maybe off your property line you cannot put something right on the edge between your neighbor and yourself so get yourself a metal detector find those property lines and make sure you do it right so you don't have to do it all over or tear something down later when it's time to buy or sell a house anyway i want to thank you again for watching my name is mark calendar with the calendar home team and remax results